So there's two obvious big problems with the ocean are what we're putting in and what we're taking out, excessive in both cases. We had a saying back in Iceland, the sea can always accept more, i.e. you can dump everything into the ocean. The ocean is vast, the ocean is large. That just isn't the case. So awareness and acceptance is the key. Eight million metric tons of plastic go into the ocean every year. Every bit of plastic ever made is still here. All these issues make it imperative for us to work together from each individual seeing what she or he can do to NGOs, companies, governments. When people meet, that's how you foster innovation. That's also how we can create new ideas and also form partnerships. Also bringing in this private sector perspective. Sustainable packaging is one of many environmental initiatives within our Coca-Cola company sustainability program. In 2025, we will no longer put packages in the marketplace that are not 100% recyclable. And then by 2030, we have an aspiration to include 50% recycled materials in all of our packaging. I think increasingly what happens at these summits is that partnerships get formed here that lead to projects on the ground. I think we're going to see collaborating in a different way that we haven't seen before. I think we're going to see companies finding that it's more valuable to share than it is to keep things close to the vest. And I think that that's really exciting. As environmentalists, we're always trying to find the economic argument to make to someone for why they should care about the ocean. And there are lots of them. But fundamentally what it comes down to is just that people connect with the ocean in a way that gives them a sense of a world that's larger than themselves, of a, of a place of peace a place of nature that they connect with. Our existence is dependent on the blue part of the planet.